Hey there! It's time for another episode of this Tech Tip series. In this Tech Tip series, we are diving into the exciting world of Powtoon. This episode is part of the Animation 101 Tech Tip series. In the previous episode, we explored how to add pre-made scene to your Powtoon project. In this video, we now explore how to use templates as your Powtoon project. Are you ready? Let's start! Using a template. To use a template, go to your workspace. Go to the left corner of the workspace where the menu bar is located. Click on the Templates button, and you will be presented with various templates. Note that the templates with pro symbols are only available for premium accounts. You can access all templates by clicking the All button. You can also sort the templates by clicking on the New Templates button, Most Popular Templates, and Premium Templates buttons. You can also filter the templates by clicking on the Filter button, which will show you different options, such as Look, Style, and Plan. Choose your preferred template to start animating. When you hover over to the template, you will see the Play button on the left lower side. Once you click the Play button, a preview will be shown to give you an idea of how it will appear in your project. Click on the Edit in Studio button to start editing. You will then be automatically directed to the studio. You can edit the elements by clicking on them and exploring the options available above. The elements shown on the stage are organized in a nested structure within the tabs. If the tabs are locked, denoted by the lock symbol, you can unlock them by clicking on the tabs. Note that nesting is important when you want a group of elements to appear together. And there you have it! You can now start to use templates for your Powtoon project. In the next Tech Tips episode, we will learn how to export your Powtoon project. See you there!